While investors are fascinated by the latest digital tokens, Cardano is making slow and deliberate progress to the top. According to analysts, Cardano's virtual currency ADA is expected to see the next big crypto rise. With this in mind, a brighter future holds for Cardano holders. Welcome to Cardano News. If you want to win 250 free ADA, see the comment section below and join our giveaway. Edward Snowden just made a major discovery concerning Cardano, revealing why holders of the cryptocurrency should be on the lookout. Edward Snowden, according to the U.S. government, broke America's laws of secrecy spectacularly, but this time he released information that could benefit Cardano investors. Did he inspire us to invest more in ADA? Stay tuned until the finish of the video to understand precisely what Cardano's future holds. Let's have a peek at what Cardano is and how much it costs. Snowden's incredible discoveries have impacted the world as we know it. He is casting devastating light on intelligence agencies and systems all across the world, and many people are reconsidering their privacy, anonymity, and security. Snowden was convinced that the world's population should not be controlled, and it is logical to break the ice on the National Security Agency's most cage initiatives as such. Snowden has established himself as someone close to the hearts of non traditionalists, co-capitalists, and active libertarians all around the world. The majority of these folks are proponents of blockchain and decentralized crypto sources, therefore it's no coincidence that Snowden is a crypto and blockchain enthusiast. In the years since the leak began, innumerable articles have been emphasized and arguments have occurred, where everyone has an opinion on Snowden and the incredible knowledge he gave the world. His activities prompted Congress to pass the USA Freedom Act, which set limits on the volume and set of information that could be watched and recorded. Edward Snowden was charged with treason and other crimes after exposing the existence of multiple American and British mass surveillance programs. Further, he was sentenced to prison for treason and other crimes, but he escaped to Russia. Also, he got mansion titles through asylum and has been living there ever since with his outrageous tales. Edward Snowden was able to pique the best interests of the country and rally a large following around him. However, the best part is that Snowden himself is a supporter of blockchain technologies in cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, Cardano, and two more coins. Unlike some of its predecessors, such as Bitcoin, which are built on proof-of-work protocols, the Cardano platform is centered around a proof-of-stake protocol. This is also why ADA is referred to as a third-generation cryptocurrency. It builds on the successes of Bitcoin. Bitcoin and Ethereum while attempting to be more stable and accessible. That means it's better for the environment, faster and more secure. Cardano establishes a new technological standard that is both diverse and welcoming, challenging the status quo and ushering in a new era of globally distributed innovation that is both sustainable and inclusive. That is why it appeals to many strategists, including Edward Snowden. The proof-of-stake protocol is meant to mine blockchain data, which means that the more coppers you have, the more quarrying power you have. Crypto experts believe Cardano will reach $10 in 2021 as a result of this cryptanalysis. In terms of price, Cardano began trading at $0.18 cents in 2021 and is now trading at $2.03 last November 14th, an 18-13% growth since the beginning of the year. Further, Cardano is expected to be worth $3.67 by the end of 2021, while many analysts believe it can reach $10. The increase from today to the end of the year could be 400% and the price of Cardano will rise to $12 in the first half of 2022, then add $2 in the second half to conclude the year at $15.06. Cardano has grown to become one of the world's most valuable cryptocurrencies, and with a market capitalization of approximately over $65 million, the coin's value has increased by 4,200% in the last year, making it the sixth largest cryptocurrency. Cardano's ADA, according to a leading portfolio strategist at Giant Morningstar, a $244 billion asset management firm, might become one of the big three mainstream cryptocurrencies. As per a story by business insider Morningstar's, crypto-focused strategist Amy Arnott believes that investors wishing to enter into crypto assets want to avoid stomach-churning fluctuations. Thus, Cardano could be the way to go. Cardano's ADA introduces connectors for DAP integration, and it continues 
continues to advance in the integration of smart contracts on its blockchain. They also announced two weeks ago that it had completed the long-awaited Alonzo White hard fork, and with this project, it was moving on to the next phase of the integration. Additionally, developers will be able to design decentralized finance on the Cardano system, despite the NFT's decentralized identity and numerous other things on the network thanks to smart contracts. This is why the network's transition to smart contract support is critical. Cardano has now developed a connector for dApps convergence on the network, utilizing its euro price moving down this path. And obviously that's a huge development. Further, the beta copy of the connection was revealed four months ago via a news release on the Emergo website, which originates from the commercial weapon and solution supplier of the Cardano ecosystem known as Euro Wallet. This was done for Cardano ADA to be able to create dApps events on the blockchain without any issues. And the connector will expand network usage globally, pulling more individuals into the decentralized global operating system. In 2013, as a one-time National Protection Bureau, NSA, and CIA employee, Edward Snowden claimed about Cardano that he was bold enough to expose state-level classified data. In addition, Edward Snowden stated that the only long-term solution is to develop structures that address all of the current system's flaws while also attracting global customers. One of the unique aspects of Cardano's development phase is that peer-reviewed engineers and academic leaders with expertise in blockchain and cryptography play a key role in its creation. Cardano is the type of cryptocurrency that sees slow and steady developments, not something that sees quick changes with specific advantages thanks to the peer review process. According to Cardano, it catches security flaws that could otherwise lead to more major problems at the last minute. But it is better in the long run, as Edward Snowden described. Furthermore, Snowden's lawyer, Ben Wisner, embarrassedly asked Edward about blockchain, admitting that he doesn't understand it. Meanwhile, Snowden deconstructed the fundamentals of a blockchain in an interview discussing what makes this newly invented data structure work and, more crucially, the usefulness of blockchains itself. Further, Snowden's comparison of blockchains to a new type of database provided Wisner with a single phrase to encapsulate the issue of trust that blockchains address. Also, consumers showered money at centralized banks indiscriminately before the Great Recession of 2008, apparently because they trusted these institutions. As the crash caused chaos on millions of people's finances, it became clear that entrusting data and money to centralized corporations was a hazardous proposition. Hence, as alluded to by Snowden, the creation of Bitcoin as the world's first bona fide blockchain network, the seeming libertarian noted, imagine that instead of today's world, where publicly important data is often held exclusively at Generic Corp LLC, which can and does play God with it at the public's expense, it's in a thousand places with a hundred jurisdictions. There is no takedown mechanism or other let's be evil button, and creating one requires a global consensus of generally at least 51% of the network in support of changing the rules. Wisner, taken aback by Snowden's technical explanation, asked his client an intriguing question. Can blockchain technology harm massive digital platform monopolies like Amazon or Google? Snowden, while cautiously hopeful about the future of this technology, believes that for the time being, overthrowing such giants from their thrones via blockchain is nothing more than a wild speculation. He did say, though, that the advent of blockchains may lead to an overly visible world in which everything can be tracked, which is a good thing. Beyond the headlines, there is now pressure on rival nations to buy Bitcoin, even if only as a reserve asset, as he recently tweeted. Today, Bitcoin was formally accepted as a legal cash in its first country. Latecomers may come to regret their hesitation because the design heavily incentivizes early adoption. To summarize, Edward Snowden views cryptocurrency as a positive phenomenon. Nonetheless, he believes that Cardano should make every effort to improve and that its potential is enormous if it does so. Rather than Bitcoin, Cardano employs proof of stake, which according to Edward Snowden is the way of the future. With all of this information, you may want to think about investing in ADA cryptocurrency to avoid any regrets in subsequent years. This could be your invitation to join the early adopters of the technology. Let us know what you think about Cardano ADA's future. That's all for this video about crypto and thank you for watching. If you would like to receive updates on the crypto market, make sure you click the subscribe and bell button.